Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm doing something a little bit different. I'm doing a q and I had asked you guys on Instagram to ask me some questions. Tell me like what you guys want to know, anything. I literally put ask me anything. And I have all the questions here. There's a lot of them. Uh, I just screenshot it and I'm just going to go through as many as I can uh, in today's video. I have my pink drink and I'm ready to start. So, let's just jump right in. I'm scared. When is your next video with Stephanie? She is bomb AF. My sister Stephanie. My sister Stephanie is something else, guys. Um, she's a character. I always tell her she needs to be a comedian or like be on a show or something because she's so fucking hilarious. I can't. I have a challenge that I'm thinking of doing and she might be in it. Uh, so Stephanie's going to be a lot of my channel. I think I might just do a whole playlist with just videos with Stephanie because she's hilarious. I tell her all the time you need like your own show. Next, what high school did you go to? I went to Florida Christian High School um, here in Miami. And in Florida Christian, I started seventh grade till senior year. I graduated from there. Uh, not like the best school in the world, I would say. But yeah, the good thing out of it was that I met the love of my life. So that's like the only good thing I would say. What is your favorite foundation? So you guys know this about me. Like I feel like every video, like previous videos, I always say my favorite foundation is the Georgia Armani Lumina Silk. Um, they don't send me stuff, so it's not advertised, I swear. Uh, I go myself and I buy the bottle. I have like a bunch of them. I go through them like nothing. I was like, okay, Melanie, slow down. I can't keep buying this. So I've done Hello Happy from Benefit, this cute little thing. Right now I have like a, a mo uh, tinted moisturizer on from Makeup Forever. Uh, you guys know I'm not big on foundations. I don't like heavy foundations. I don't even like foundations in general. I normally just wear concealer all day every day so normally i go for something super light like hello happy or from benefit or something like uh tinted moisturizer from let me show you guys it's actually right here it's in my drawer um so i have like a little basket of my concealers and foundations in here and then i have like a basket of my lip products this is like my everyday stuff in here like literally what I like to use like my holy grail shit that I like to use all the time uh, so in here I have my foundations and concealers and contours or whatnot and I literally I kid you not it's all concealers so I only have three foundations it's the makeup forever tinted moisturizer that I use today in the shade four another hello happy I go in between the shades oh that's dirty and the shade four and five and back and forth and the It Cosmetic CC Cream, which I think is super full coverage. It's actually really heavy, so I like to use that like if I go out like to a bar or out to dance or whatnot with Christian. So I'll use that one. Uh, but in general, my favorite foundation overall would be Giorgio Armani because it's so luminous and so lightweight. That's why I like these two, all, like all of these that I just showed you guys because I like foundations that are super lightweight. Next question. How is it working for BoxyCharm? It looks like so much fun. Love being on their stories. I love testing new products and seeing things. It's really opened my eyes to how everything works. It's crazy, but it's not like a show for stories. Like literally how that that's how it is every day, like naturally. I love it. I really do like it, guys. BoxyCharm is the shit. Okay, I saw this one. Can you please make a tutorial of your makeup routine? I actually do have this. It's um, not my, it's like my last, if you go to like my last uploads, it's my everyday makeup routine. I do have that, so you can check that out. Next question. Are you fluent in Spanish? Yes, I'm very fluent in Spanish. My parents taught me Spanish first, so I went into school only speaking Spanish uh, when I was younger, like in kindergarten. So I learned English in school because my mom like only spoke Spanish with me in the house. So that's my, th I'm very fluent. I know how to say, hola, yo puedo coger una orden de arroz, frijoles. A pechuga de pollo, una de tostones, like, I know how to speak Spanish. It's it's not correct Spanish because Cubans don't speak correct Spanish. We speak like a slang, like a Cuban slang. My mom, do you love me? Of course I love you. My mom is like my best friend. I fucking love my mom. The best. I relate to my mom so much. I tell my mom everything. I like have the best relationship with my mom, so... Uh, definitely. I just think my parents in general, they're just so young because they had us pretty young. 
so my parents are just like fun and crazy and outgoing and they're just great so but like how come you haven't had a meet and greet in Miami I'm just scared that like I don't know like what if I do one and like no one comes like I don't know I don't know if I have a lot of people here in Miami people like that message me from Saudi Arabia from London from uh dubai from china it's it's literally crazy so so many people international especially like hispanics and stuff so i'm like do i have a lot of followers here from miami like local like if i do a meet and greet i don't know maybe one day i'll do it maybe i'll do like a poll if like if i did a meet and greet would you go and maybe we'll have one i don't know let's see what is the age difference between you and your sister i love the relationship you guys have so me and stephanie are two years apart she's 23 i'm 21 uh so for the question of how old i am 21 years old just turned 21 august 4th i'm a leo okay i love this one any wedding plans between you and your boyfriend i love y'all <laughs> okay guys i wish i knew but unfortunately i don't get to propose it's christian so uh of course i would love to be um married to him i fucking love christian he's a very simple person if it was up to me i would probably just go like carry bradshaw and get married in court i will have a wedding because he is an only child and my mother-in-law really wants to see us get married and walk down an aisle and whatnot and my mom too so uh we will have a very very small small intimate wedding uh which is what we've always thought of doing uh but i would need to get engaged first of course we've always we're all we openly talk about when we get married when we get engaged when this and that you guys will see it first obviously my wedding will be on here on youtube for sure um when i get engaged he says we're gonna film it it's gonna be on youtube so you guys will see that too you guys won't miss out on anything i promise how do you like being instagram famous overnight guys it's really crazy and i tell christian every day like it hasn't hit me at all my followers, my everything, it really has not hit me that this is, like, all real to me. Um, it's crazy because it was, like, one, po Kylie Jenner posted my video on her cosmetic page twice, like, in the span of four days. And it was just, like, insane to me because I would get reposted by other makeup pages, but, like, Kylie Jenner, you know? I know that she she doesn't handle, obviously, her cosmetic page. Someone, she, someone runs it for her. But, like, she goes on and she sees, you know, the videos that go up, obviously, to make sure her page is running well. So, it was honestly, like, crazy to me. I still think it's crazy. Like, I got YouTube followers from everything and I was like, what? Like, till this day, I think it's... I'm probably... It hasn't really hit me yet. Uh, but I'm so grateful every day for what I'm able to do. Like, this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. How many cats do you have? You look like you have a zoo. I do have a zoo. I have right now eight cats. Two of them are like my, my babies that I will be taking with me when I leave this house. It's the mom and her daughter. Uh, I rescued her. A lot of these cats are strays that I take in and I feed because I'm never not going to feed an animal. I love to help and rescue animals. I always tell Christian when, you know, hopefully in the future, God willing, if we have, you know, if we're financially well, I would love to open my own shelter and stuff. I just love animals so much, and I know I'm gonna, Christian's gonna kill me, because when we live together, I'm just gonna pick up any animal I see on the street, and I already told him, I'm like, just prepara that because there's gonna be, our house is gonna be a zoo. What is a secret talent you have? Oh my God, I have no talent. I can't even run, you guys. I would do miles in PE, and I would just walk them, because I, I'm not even athletic. Like, I was born to just do makeup, guys, I swear. It's crazy. Um, I don't know, what is something crazy I do? Oh, I can move my ears. Ready? Isn't that weird? So, maybe a lot of people do know how to do it, but that's like the only thing I can think of. If you guys want to see a video with Steph, I know it's coming up very soon. You should subscribe to make sure you watch out for that video. It's going to be a challenge. It's going to be crazy. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed listening to me talk a little bit about my life and about some questions that you guys always want to know. Um, maybe that helped you learn a little bit more about me, more about my life, my family, Christian. Because I want always for you guys to feel like I'm not this like YouTuber, Instagram person you guys just like watch and she's like doesn't talk. Like I want this to be a relationship with me and you guys. Like let's be friends, let's talk and let's do makeup and let's do challenges and let's do this and I want to be able to like 
always be in communication with you guys because I don't treat you as fans. I don't like that word. I treat you like friends and, you know, people who support me and whoever supports me, I love. So I will see you guys next Wednesday.